Hi, my name is Colin Zauner. I'm an Applications Engineer here at KEB America. This will be an introductory video to our CombiVis Studio HMI software. We're going to cover three different things today. The first thing being uh, the types of devices that we have available that you can program our HMI uh, programs to. The second thing will be the various types of HMI runtimes that are available for each device. And lastly, we will cover how to download our CombiVis Studio HMI software for free from our website. Our HMI programs run on either a Windows Compact Embedded operating system, which is typically found on our HMIs, the DIN rail mounted IPC, which is our C6 Smart, or the C6 Router. A typical HMI program uh, you could see um, would be on our HMI product here, or it could be um, on our C6 Smart uh, from the DVI port here. Uh, the C6 router, you can develop HMI projects which can be seen um, as a dashboard visualization and you can see this when you remotely log into it. Uh, you can also develop data logging projects and implement alarm notifications such as email notifications or text messages uh, remotely from the C6 router. And this is our IPC, which comes in three different hardware options. This being the box mount version. We also have a book mount version, which is a more compact form factor. And lastly, we have a panel mount version, um, which comes in either a capacitive or a resistive touch uh, screen option. All of our IPCs generally come with the Windows standard embedded operating system. Uh, which can be used uh, with our HMI programs. Our HMI software comes preloaded with a lot of powerful functionality that allows you to create scalable and dynamic HMI applications. Some of the canned functionality that comes preloaded with our HMI software is an extensive graphic library, also alarm management, data logging, trending, uh, user management. We also have over 40 plus COM drivers that allow you to connect to not only KEB PLCs but also to other commonly used PLCs on the market such as Allen Bradley, Siemens, Omron, um, and many others. And lastly for functionality that isn't already implemented in the HMI software, uh, you can use scripts that are written in Visual Basic to handle any of that extra functionality. All of our devices can be ordered with one of three different HMI runtimes, either the basic, pro, or advanced runtime. Each tier comes with a different level of functionality. Going from the basic to the pro to the advanced, you get an increasing amount of functionality. So going from basic to pro, you get an increase in tags, comm drivers, as well as a web visualization option. Next, we're going to download the CombiVis Studio HMI software from our website. The software that we download today uh, will be fully functional, however it will be in demo mode. Uh, in demo mode, uh, you will have access to all of the features within the software. However, since it, it'll be unlicensed, it will shut down every hour and you will not be able to save boot applications in your hardware that you program to. To download, go to kebamerica.com, go to the Control and Automation tab, and on the right side, under Tools and Development Environment, select CombiVis Studio HMI. This will bring you to the main page of our CombiVis Studio HMI software. From this page, you will see links to our catalogs, FAQs, and then also um, a link to the software download. On the right hand of the screen, under Documentation, select the Setup CombiVis Studio HMI 5.0. This will be the EXE that will install our software. 
Once the setup.exe has completed downloading, you can now begin programming.